You thought we were done with retail. No, 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 no. There's more drama. More drama. Somebody call Keemstar. Because there's more drama. And let's get into it. 2017 retail closings. Here's what you need to know. It's the article talking about what's closing, blah, 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 blah. And that you should spend your gift cards at these retailers ASAP because they are dying. They're going to close. We're going to go down the list. There's actually some stuff here I didn't know that was closing. Uh, and that have closed. So starting up first on the list, Tiavana. I'm a member at the Tiavana Corporation. A member as in a customer, but they've got like a rewards membership program thing, I think, or something like that. I signed up for something. Anyway, I love tea. But I don't go there enough. And it's people like me who just don't go there enough. They're closing all their stores. Tiavana is owned by Starbucks. And uh, Starbucks is pulling pulling the uh, trigger on Tiavana. All 379 stores, most of them are in malls, are gone or going by the end of this year. Uh, next up, and I've already made videos on both these companies, Sears and Kmart. They're closing 43 additional stores. Nothing new there. Moving on. JC Penney. I have not done a video on JC Penney besides mentioning it in the past, but I've not done a uh, walking through JC Penney video, which I should probably do. In fact, that's on my list. Uh, by next week, there will be a video of me walking through JC Penney showing you guys why it's going. Moving on. Macy's. That's another one I need to do too. Now, they're not quite dead, but they're not doing well. And they have 68 more stores closing by the end of this year. Jimboree. Jimboree is a uh, company that focuses on children's clothing. They are closing 350 stores uh, and they are in Chapter 11 bankruptcy. So not doing not doing so well, Jimboree. Not doing so well. Michael Kors. Now, Michael Kors, obviously MK, everybody knows the MK brand. Uh, they're closing 125 stores by the end of this year. Uh, as part of a restructuring. Uh, Payless Shoe Source, 512 stores and counting. Payless. <sighs> Payless, Payless. That reminds me of the 90s. Just saying the name Payless Shoe Source. I mean, guys, I'm surprised you're still here, honestly. I remember that right next to Venture, if you guys remember what Venture is, there was a Payless. And it's just, it's so early 90s to me. Like, and just that's, I'm surprised they're still around. Uh, moving up next, uh, moving on next, is Bebe Stores. They have closed everything, I believe. They have 180 stores, or they had 180 stores, and yeah, they're gone. Goodbye, Bebe. Rue 21, 400 stores closing. Um, but they still have quite a few. They're just not doing so well. I don't even know what Rue 21 is. Um, doesn't really say. Probably some clothing company, I'm sure. Moving on. Abercrombie and Fitch. I hate Abercrombie and Fitch because I hate the CEO of Abercrombie and Fitch. He said fat people uh, didn't deserve to be in a store. So it's kind of negative press in, in my opinion. Um, closing 60 stores uh, and then after that they will have 670 remaining stores. But I don't see them here in five years. They'll be gone. So the CEO He's up his own ass, and so, anyway, guess it's closing 60 stores. Um, and, uh, let's see, moving on, Crocs, you guys know what Crocs are. Those disgusting looking shoes, they're closing 160 stores. Uh, the Limited, closing 250 stores. I didn't even know the Limited was still around, to be honest. Um, oh. Okay, that's all their stores. They're closing down. So they're going to be strictly online only from here on out. And that's that's not the only one that's doing that. American Apparel closing the remaining 110 stores. They were bought by Gildan, the activewear company that makes t-shirts and activewear obviously. And they're going to be, uh, they're going to be, it looks like, online only. So, so long American Apparel. BCBG, I don't even know what that is. They're closing 120 of those stores. Um... And then Gander Mountain, undetermined. It says it has 126 stores total. There's a new CEO, and he intends to keep dozens of locations open. Dozens, not all 126, obviously. Uh, another big one, and this kind of reminds me of Circuit City, H.H. Gregg. Now, I've never been to an H.H. Gregg. They don't have them here in Kansas City, but they do have the commercials on my TV. 
And I don't know why, because there's no HHG Greg around here for miles, for hundreds of miles. Uh, they have 132 stores, but they are going completely out of business, and they're going to start liquidation at all 132 stores. Uh, and they're all going to be closed by the end of May, so it's already happened. Okay, all right. Uh, which is why you don't see the commercials anymore. Greg's got it. Now Greg doesn't got it. GameStop is closing 150 plus stores. That's not surprising. Um, you know, the more I, I find myself more and more buying games off of uh, the PlayStation Store uh, and the Xbox Marketplace. And uh, now I did pre-order Destiny at GameStop, but even then, Amazon's starting to be better than GameStop. I mean, you can get a, like a new game these days, new copy. You have to wait two days. Prime, big whoop. But forty-seven dollars is the lowest I've seen a game go for. Just not bad. Uh, and that's a new game that just released, you know. So that Amazon, in every way possible, is killing retail, and I love it. I really do. Staples is closing seventy stores. They just opened up a new Staples a couple years ago over here, for some reason. Family Christian closing two hundred and forty stores. Um, oh, wow. And then it says, read more. Family Christian closing all 240 locations. So, I don't know if that's shown or not. So, they're just gone, I guess. Family Christian stores. Uh, which is, you know, whatever. I think Mardell's a, a um, better brand if you're into the Christian bookstores. Uh, Mardell seems to be a little bit better than Family Christian. Um, CVS is closing 70 locations across the country, but you know what? They got hundreds. I'm not even worried about them. And so, yeah. Basically, if I listed anything that you have gift cards for, go use them now because it's not going to matter here pretty soon. Um, like I said, I do I do plan to do a JCPenney store video. Um, and uh, I hear there are four Radio Shacks still around in my area. Four Radio Shacks? If so, I'm going to do a video in there as well. So stay tuned for that, guys. Just thought I'd let you know. The end of retail is, is near. <laughs> Online is king. And Target and Walmart have realized that. Walmart owns Jet. Target's just Target. And Amazon is at the top of the throne. Sitting on the throne, I guess. So, anyway. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you on the next video. Peace.